All right, away from the opening of the Court of Appeal, the National Assembly retreat and induction is coming to an end today at Safari Park Hotel in Nairobi with several issues emerging among them, the CDF and equally the allowances that we've been seeing them being discussed all through the week. And I want us to link up with our political affairs reporter, Daniel Kariuki, joining us live from Safari Park. Kariuki, good afternoon. What should we expect in the final day? I thank you very much, Ashley. You said it right, uh, that today is the last day of the retreat by the National Assembly members of Parliament, of course, induction to uh, the 13th uh, Parliament that is going to officially begin uh, next week, Thursday, when uh, the President, uh, William Ruto, will uh, address uh, the National Assembly as well as the Senate, the Joint House sitting. And of course, uh, it being uh, the retreat by National Assembly, several issues have been discussed, just like you have put it, CDF, as well as uh, members' allowances, sitting allowances in the plenary is part of what that has formed uh, the discussions here at the retreat. And uh, immediately I want to uh, engage with the nominated member of parliament, uh, John Buddy, so, so as to bring us to speed uh, with the letters and what we are expecting. And, of course, being uh, the last day of the retreat. Thank you very much for joining us here on KTN News. And the first thing, first, so far uh, from the retreat, what can we say uh, has the set agenda uh, by the um, uh, the National Assembly been achieved in matters to do with the preparations for the 13th uh, Parliament? I think uh, now this has become a tradition that any time uh, the new parliament is coming into place that the members are taken through the process of legislation, uh, taken through the process of oversight, how to do budget and all that and how generally to execute their duties. They are also um, inducted into...